All right, so we just had the U.S. presidential election results come in, and Trump has won in a landslide for the electoral vote and slightly for the popular vote. So, yep, Trump has won the election for this election. Yep, and hopefully, the thing is, I used to support Harris. I no longer do. I no longer support her. Based on um, opinions I've heard from other people recently, I no longer support Harris now. So, yeah. Anyways, Trump has won the election for this for the 2024 election. He has won. Mm -hmm. And, well, one thing I like to say is hopefully democracy will not be destroyed. So, yeah. But now I'm, like, not supporting eight or one. So, yeah. I mean, I had my opinions public out there. There was this video I made about going back to school and supporting Harris back on September 2nd or September 3rd of 2023, I think it was 2nd, it was a 2020, no, 2024 this year, sorry. So, in that video, I talked about the situation in my school and endorsing Harris, even though I'm Republican, but now I no longer support her. I changed my mind about her. I changed my mind. So, yeah. So, now I would vote Nader one. Did one pretty much. As far as I'm gonna tell you. But yeah, so now my vote is private. I'm not gonna tell you if I vote Trump or Harris now, like what I give the slight edge to. What I will say public is I just say I would rather do neither one. Okay? So yeah. That's what I would say. So yeah, we just ended the twenty twenty four election, Trump won. It's all over for Harris. Yep, she lost her lead. She has lost. She has been defeated by Trump. Donald Trump. Trump 2025. He, he won the election. Yes, he has won the election. Mm hmm Yep, it's, this is a big moment in American history. Anyways, this was the 2024 election results from November 5th yesterday from election night. As Trump has won. Anyways, that is that. Those are the results for this election. Trump won. Big time. So yep, yeah, those are the results. And anyways, this is this is a Republican right here, Peter Towers, and goodbye.